So welcome once again. So in this video, I am going to talk about mind. So um, if you had uh, read books on that, um, about what is mind, or uh, heard someone talking on that, so mostly it pertains to thoughts. It's, they say it as it's a bundle of thoughts. Yeah, I agree with thinking is a faculty and we think and thoughts come. But based on uh, hypnosis as well as uh, NLP models, um, we can consider mind as a software and this body as an hardware. So when we consider mind as a software, it is not only thinking, there is something beyond that. Why we are thinking what we are thinking? So it's a good question to ask why I am thinking what I am thinking, right? So there are programs that is running, so to make decision, to make a choice, to have options, to analyze, to strategize, to plan, and it is like a kind of uh, regular routines that keeps on running inside our mind. It's not only thinking and behind that there are many things that's happening. So mind, hypothetically, there is a construct. The construct is, you know, there's a conscious mind and there is a subconscious mind. Sigmund Freud calls it as unconscious mind and then uh, you find the new literature, they call it a subconscious mind. So, in between conscious and uh, subconscious, there is a wall-like structure. These are all hypothetically the wall-like structure, we call it as judgmental mind. So, conscious mind is the space where we keep on thinking. And uh, we think and then we act, means we behave. Let's say, I am thinking inside and then I am talking to you. And then if you can also relate it to my hand gesture that's happening and the facial gesture. It means there is a thinking and there is a doing. So conscious mind is all about thinking and uh, doing. And when it comes to the judgmental mind, there is a kind of analysis that happens, the comparison that happens, the choices that we go through, right? And the uh, planning that we me. So, judgment is all about uh, whether it is right for me or wrong for me. So, that process keeps on happening. And subconscious mind is a storehouse. You can say that it's a storehouse where we store all the painful as well as pleasurable memories. So, memories get stored in the subconscious mind as painful memories and pleasurable memories. So, whenever I look at this uh, mobile phone that I am talking here. So I uh, understand that it's a mobile phone because it, it got stored inside my memory. And I can use this fe features because I know that uh, from my memory. Now the moment uh, I look at a snake over there, then something triggers inside me. Means the thoughts, I keep, I keep thinking whether what kind of snake is that. And if it is going to be my feelings that you now I get feared and then I want to run away from that environment. So, mind is not only thoughts and mind is a software and you have many things underlying these thoughts and uh, mind has a conscious mind, judgmental mind and a subconscious mind. The conscious mind we think, we decide and then we act on that. The subconscious mind there are memories that are stored and each time that when we are uh, interacting with the external world we get accessed to our subconscious memory, we relate to that to understand what it is, what it is not and whether it is useful or not and then we access all our emotions from there and then we 
take action. So, keep on watching and subscribing to us and uh, we are going to share more and more. Thank you.